In this lesson, we're going to look at one more inequality dealing with triangles. And this one deals with the sides. <coughs> so as you can see, we're looking at adding two of the sides together. And we're going to see how does it compare to the third side of the triangle. I have a sketch pad file here to help us with that. So you can see the three side lengths as I change my triangle. Those side lengths will change. If I take and add two of them together, now what I want to do is I want to compare this green to this purple. I guess the biggest one I want to look at is when I get over here. Notice <coughs> the green right now is smaller. Even when I was way back here, the green was smaller than the purple. If I get it over here, green's still smaller, still smaller. The only time it's going to become equal is when it gets to this point. Now when you look at that, hopefully you're, everybody's looking at that saying, well, that's not even a triangle, it's just a segment. You're right. So what this theorem is telling us is if we add the two sides together, it's always going to be larger than the third side, no matter what we do. And as you see in Sketchpad here, that's becoming true. No matter where I'm at, as long as it's a triangle, my red and my blue sides added together, those two lengths will always be larger than the third side, the green side. Bring us back here. So underneath here, I have the greater than symbol and then in the, the actual words of the theorem, put the word greater than in there. And that's going to conclude the lesson on the inequality, or this inequality dealing with the sides of a triangle.